If you Google, do songbirds eat fungus? You yourself will see that there's a little information regarding it. I'm talking about ornithomycology, the study of birds and fungus. There's now significant efforts and interest dedicated to understanding their relationships. One world study found that at least 54 species of birds would feed on fungus, and at least 176 species were using fungal material in nest construction. I definitely knew they were using different types of lichen to build their nests and to help build their nests, but I never knew they were using pieces of fungus. So here we go. How many of you out there have seen a bird feeding on either a mushroom or some type of fungal growth? The only other video I could really find was a hawk eating fungus, which I found very awesome. I put the link to that in the video description for you. There have also been birds like larks that have been known to dig for desert truffles. Truffles? Yum. Since fungus are rich in minerals and contain water, they can benefit any bird willing to consume them. As far as building nests, one of the most frequently used mushrooms are those little umbrella-shaped ones. Some fungi used in nests will continue to grow, and that can serve as a glue to strengthen and improve the structural integrity of the nest, especially once it starts getting weighed down by the growing babies. One study theorized that some of the fungi being used in nests produce their own potent chemical compounds that can serve as an ectoparasite deterrent, which would add to a nestling's health keeping those little babies safe from bacteria and little parasites. The role of birds in fungal spore dispersal from their droppings is understudied, while the prominence of birds spreading seeds through their feces is. Birds are actually crucial and widely recognized as important to the establishment of plants in new locations. Some birds disperse fungal spores over various distances via their feathers. Just by getting it on their feathers, flying to new locations, landing, and then falling off into the ground there. It's also thought that birds also might consume and disperse mycorrhizal fungi due to secondary consumption. You know, they're feeding on insects and soil invertebrates that are already known to consume and disperse fungal spores on their own, and they're eating them and then wherever their droppings land uh, is where fungal spores can, can grow. So yeah, I'm just so thankful for this chickadee here we've been watching and another opportunity to present further evidence that songbirds too are mycophagous. They eat fungus. And we can note too that this video was taken during the winter time, so food supply is generally limited, but regardless, and for the purposes of this video, here's proof that these birds are fungivores. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the woods.